Hello everybody, and welcome to Pokemon Scarlet. I'm just gonna jump in because I've already gotten pretty... F not too far for my main one. I didn't really want to record it for one purpose. I was looking for a female... <laughs> Theme, uh, yeah, female Pokemon. And that's, uh, I believe, a 1 in 8 chance or a 12.5 chance of trying to get. So, 1 in 8th? I think I got it on the 7th reset or 8th. So, yeah. Let's jump in. Taking lessons from traditional, growing stronger and greater. It's time for you to... To dive into the world of Pokemon. <clears throat> Director Calavan, head of the Raja Academy. I'm not good at saying Pedalia. Paldea is a sprying region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also, of course, home to the mystical creations known as, to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers, in fact. The Electric little dude Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas, the skies, and even cities and towns. We humans coexist with Pokemon as both as we both help one another to live and thrive. The academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners. Within our halls, people from all over the region gather to together, and as Pokemon trainers, they have their own Pokemon to do battle growing alongside them, while our robust <clears throat> camaraderies of coursework to help our students draw forth their full potential. It is within these halls that you will find your friends, the Pokemon True Self. We, uh, Academy, can't wait to welcome you with open arms. Jeez. And the box legendary for Scarlet. Uh, yeah, Scarlet. Wow. So I'm just going to leave this play in the background. It looks so good on bigger TV. I can't wait to play it. Houston, we have a problem. Save, I am getting rid of you right away. Time to get up. Uh, 
Oh, yes, that's right. You cannot run. Ba -ba -ba show. Turn that off. I don't need to do nicknames. And fast text speech. Perfect. Now I can continue on with the game. Hey, you were in the last game. Get back here. Ah, oh, the rodent got it again. No, it's adorable. Good morning. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. Well, it is your first day at the new school after all. I'm so excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go race out the door. The school contacted me and said they are that you're supposed to wait just a little longer. Their words, not mine. Apparently, there's something very important for your first day it still hasn't arrived ding dong doorbell maybe that's the very thing we've been waiting for get the door would ya sure thing do forgive the intrusion you are a master. Name. Yes. On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment document. Ah, and also for my delay in introducing myself. I am the director of the Academy. You may call me Calvel. Calvel? Like I said, I'm not very good at saying names. The director. And you came in person to help my son with the first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any failures on its part. So here's the last of the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Goodness, you really needn't have since you came all the w this way can I at least offer you a cup of tea ah no need to trouble yourself I got a thing or two to discuss with the director here why don't you head up to your room and finish getting ready for school you'll need your bag and your hat as well now, Miss, Mr. Director, that's what I will call him when I can. You simply must join me for a cup. Cuppa. This way. Well, I can't refuse such a kind offer. All right, upstairs. do grab my bag I'm all orange yep I hope I can definitely change at some point I probably can can't wait though All right, I'm done. Oh, just look, uh, already, shoot, I m missed everything. Yes, the uniform of our study, 
Sturdy Academy suits you quite well indeed. Oh, gracious. How very careless of me. I had entirely forgotten that I have something else for you, Master. Name. Griff. A most important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? I wonder what is what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director. See shall we? Gotcha. Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. We provide each student entering the academy with a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to hear to have as your Pokemon. Brigadito, the grass cat Pokemon. Hmm. Way Coco, the fire croc Pokemon. And Quaxley, the duck Pokemon. The duckling, sorry, my apologies. They're all very good company. Why, they usually refuse to even leave my side. What's this? Hmm. So it turns out they're more interested in you. A then fairly old me than <laughs> familiar old me. I do wish I could stay to see which one of you you'll choose, but I must be off to the next house to visit. I'll be at the house just over there. Take your time with your decision then I'll come then come find me when your mind is made up now if you'll excuse me next till we next meet what a mannerly fellow that director is of yours is these three are all lovely but you need to choose just one right not an easy task why not take the opportunity to walk about with these ones and get to know them? I'm sure you, they have lots to teach you. Oh, but before you go, I just got a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going on your out on your own. Sweet, the Rotom phone. It's brand a brand new phone. According to the instruction, you can press uh, you can check the map application by pressing Y. What do you mean press Y, Mom? It'll help keep you from getting lost. So take good care of your new gadget, okay? Now off you go. Have fun. Now, I would like to point out a few things. There's a few items, like, around. There's an item up there I have no clue how to get. So, due to the fact that right now it doesn't matter what Pokemon I get, because I already started a file, I'm just doing this because I didn't want to record and reset until I got the Pokemon I the gender I wanted anyway so I want to see Sprigatito how it looks and I'm happy I can run now but like I said there's a bunch of items around here there's a I think that's a I need to up down 
there's an item there, which, yeah. I look completely different in the other file, but I'm getting all three starters like I usually do, so no worries there. Quagsley! Who I actually nicknamed in my true file. Sprigatito, who I will pick for this file. And... Way Coco. Which lights an orange on fire. <laughs> I guess he likes it charred. Are these three... Wait, what? Are you these three's trainer? Not quite. Master Griff just yet came to make his own choice. You see? I do wonder which of them will he be picking. <laughs> Quaxley, uh, dude, don't eat that. Ah, uh, that was funny. So yeah, I actually spent like probably 10 minutes trying to get a female. I have no clue how to say that. We haven't met, have we? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite too soon. Hang on, Director. Is this who I think it is? Yes, this is our Academy's newest student. He will be attending as of today. So, you're that kid who moved up in the road. I've been dying to find out more about you. I'm... Pneumonia? Like I said, I'm not very good with saying names. I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Want to be friends? I think I said, yeah, I said no. <laughs> Yikes. Huh? What's wrong? Did I scare you off? Maybe I came on too strong. Is president of our school's council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. I absolutely love Pokemon battles. In fact, we should have a Pokemon right now. You and me. I have no Pokemon currently. Give me a second, please. Easy now. You two are s will be in the same class, so you'll have plenty of time to battle later. And get to know one... To know one other better, of course. We're gonna be neighbors and classmates. Nice. We'll be able to battle all we want. Help me, Director. <laughs> she scares me. <laughs> On that note... You have to Have you decided which one of these Pokemons you would like to be your first partner Pokemon? Yes, Cat. I love you so much. Brigatito. It can use its plant's power to soak up whatever water you throw at it. I just want to, uh... Ooh. The whole world shifts and the shadows. Bruh. The Fue Quick... Fue Coco. Ugh. A fire-type Pokemon. The burning hot spark, it... Scars will f fry any and all plants in its f flash. In a flash. No. That's Quexley, a water type Pokemon. It may seem quiet, but it mighty streams of water can put out any flame. You'll see. So I choose Quaxley and I give it a nickname, which you'll find out in 
part two. But anyway, I just wanted to see. No, we are not giving you a nickname. Cutscene. That is adorable. I think Qu Quagsley just does a hair flip thing. Well, I'm actually happy. Uh, Sprigatito seems to have taken quite a liking to you. This is your first Pokemon, yes? Please raise it with loving care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. Griff, I can't believe you actually choose Sprigatito. I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a great, good combo. I can choose one of these Pokemon too. Right, Director? Oh, but didn't you receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focused on racing at the time. But now I want to race a new Pokemon alongside while he raises his own new po partner. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on equal footing with me, here I shall be more than happy to allow it. Yes. Take the duck. Since Drew's Sprigatito, I'll go for this one. Nice to meet you, Quaxley. Welcome to the team. Alright then. Now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down back at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. As you may have noticed, is a tad over fond of Pokemon battling. <laughs> but I hope you'll join her for a battle. It will help you get to know your own Pokemon as well. And here you could open up your map. Tells you about auto heal. Sorry, that ain't the map. This is the map. Which gives you all the information. Which is pretty cool. There is currently a Magikarp. There's an item. Potion. Sadly, you will not be needing it for this fight. There's an item way I was about to say there so I'll quickly grab it and turn around and talk to you her anyone can be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have a Pokemon by their side and it is our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger through battles. So, are you ready to battle me? Yes. Perfecto. I'm excited for this battle. I think I'll use... <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't be fair. I trust you remember that is... Indeed a inexperienced to Pokemon battles. Ha, huh, oops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out the new buddy instead. Come on. Let's have a fruitful battle.
The characters are so nice looking. The designs. Can't wait to see more trainers and more people. I know this is the first time battle, so let's just have some fun. So I never bothered Ah, I see you don't really say anything. And that's physical, so... must have been studying up. Smart move. Grass is strong against water. And why did you pick the water type? Like, they could have made her a strong rival. But I guess they wanted to just be easy. I'm not sure. Wow, not bad, neighbor. Thanks for the money. Look at you, winning the first battle ever. You got even more potential than I thought. You're gonna be a strong trainer, for sure. But now, I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. And that was my phone going off. Uh, Master uh, and Esprigotito are surely worry from that last battle. Ah, sorry, I kind of got caught up in the excitement. I'm really sorry. It, same to your Esprigotito, too. Don't worry about it. Let's battle again soon. Oh, definitely. We'll definitely battle more. You two seem to be becoming fast friends. <laughs> though you're... Though you've only just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate under your wing? I'm sure he can learn a great deal from a... Champion ranked trainers such as yourself. You bet, sir. Ah, that reminds me. Since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you'll definitely need. You have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a sec. The Pokedex app was added. Nice. The Pokedex will automatically register any Pokemon you caught or seen. It's a must-have. Oh no, it registers them if I caught them, but it will say shown that I've seen them. A super handy app. Our hometown, our home teacher, Miss Jehu, actually made it himself. Back in the day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to complete our Pokedex. It's quite the age we live in now. Huh. Huh. Out filling out a Pokedex by hand. I can't even imagine how much work that would take. Takes a long time. Oh, there was writing, right? I missed something, I think. Oh. No, I suppose you couldn't. Yet, no matter how much time may change, the wonders of meeting Pokemon never does. That is truly time... Timeless... Precious. precious. And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. 
I hope you both will work hard towards the goal of completing your Pokedexes. Now, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. Could I depend on you to see Master to the Academy? Will you... You would be doing me quite a, the favor. Of course, leave it to me. Then I leave it him in your capable hands. Alright, little one, it's time for you and I. We're on our way. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokedexes, you probably never caught a Blight of Pokemon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the academy. Come with me. Follow me. Doesn't matter. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah, this, this is going to go a little longer. Mostly after this and one more cutscene. Oh, I heard that here we'll be taking you to the school. That's right, madam. Leave it to me. So you already managed to make a friend. And I read all about all the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you at the school. Plus, so m many handy faculties you can use as much as you like. Add in uh, your new friend, and it sounds like your school's life is shaping up to be fantastic. Now, you'll be studying in the school dorm, so I want you to promise you'll eat proper meals. Here's a, a bit of spending money to start you off with. I also packed a lunch for you for your first day. Thanks, Mom. Mmm. Oh. And maybe you better take these two. Ooh. Use them on that precious little partner of yours. Should should it get hurt in battle. I know every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experience. Fa far from home. Just try to f sa s savor them all. Wow. It took me a some time to get that out of my mouth. The words. The good times and the hard times too. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. Oh, alright then. You two had better head off, I suppose. Take care on your way to school. Thanks, Mom. Your mother is so nice. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, Vominos! She did Adora. This way! She pulled Adora with Vominos. Awesome. So yeah, as soon as you enter that way... I know another cutscene will play, so that's where I left off. I just wanted to repick the Pokemon, and I've already picked. Uh... I did not know this! Leon? Oh no. <laughs> I did not know I could do this. I was just spinning around for fun. I like that. I did not know I could do that. 
That's so hilarious. But anyway, I'm going to end off this part here. Sorry it was over the usual time, like uh, about roughly six minutes over. So without further ado, Dark Beat 32, signing off.